A mini robotic gun and an armed troop are in search of the rare Lithospermum glabra plant in the forest. They encounter a woman and are subsequently attacked by a giant snake, leading to the troop's defeat. During the ruckus, a soldier falls into a cave with the rare plant and reports his discovery to the base. He also encounters the woman again, but thinks he's hallucinating. Back in the city, Xiangai Pharmaceuticals is having a meeting with its owner, lead scientist Lin Chang and the board members. It is revealed at the meeting that the pharmaceutical company is trying to get its hands on the Lithospermum glabra, which they believe can repair human DNA. But all their attempts to get the plant have drastically failed. However, this time, the board is giving them a last chance to obtain the plant and begin their research as soon as possible. Lin Chang will be accompanied by Yang Fan, a security consultant who used to work for Blackwater and his team of hunters in order to retrieve the plant. After preparations have been made, Lin Chang sets out on his expedition with Yang Fan and his team. Not long after they set out, the expedition gets attacked by giant river bats. They, however, fight the creatures off, but during the commotion they manage to attract the attention of the giant snake that immediately attacks them. During the attack, Lin Cheng falls into the water and starts to drown. But things take an unexpected turn when the snake girl saves his life. Back in the forest, the snake goes after the survivors of the expedition, which are down to Yang Fan's best men and good friends. The team, however, proves their worth by setting up their high-tech bombs that blow off on detection and fighting back with their weapons seemingly designed to especially attack the snake. The snake gets chained up with an electrically laced chain, while the men fire relentlessly at the creature. Meanwhile, the snake girl sits beside Lin Chang, whom she had just saved, marvel to see and sniff such a wonderful young man. When Lin Chang finally wakes up, the snake girl senses that her snake friend is in trouble and rushes to find him. Lin Chang follows, and as they arrive at the attack site, the girl takes an arrow for the snake, causing the creature to get agitated and break free of the chain. As the snake attacks the men one after the other, Lin Chang picks the girl up and returns to civilization with her. The following morning, the girl wakes up to find herself in a rather strange environment with no trees, grasses, or vines. She takes off the medical aids attached to her body jumps off the bed and starts looking around. Meanwhile, downstairs is Lin Cheng and the daughter of the owner of Jiang Hai Pharmaceuticals, Miss Jiang. Lin Cheng is on a video call with her father and informs him about a bracelet made from the rare plant which he found with the snake girl. He also informs Mr. Zhang Hai that he plans to keep the girl and study her to get more information about the plant. Halfway through the call, Miss Jiang hangs up. She then tries to seduce Lin Cheng, but gets interrupted by the snake girl, whom she calls security on. The girl gets scared and rushes out of the house, and Lin Cheng follows her. However, Lin Cheng, being very weak, is unable to catch up to her. He spends the rest of the day following her trails around town, until he comes to her rescue when she gets trapped in a shocking chain with a bunch of clueless guys. The shock reminds her of her snake friend and how hurt it must have felt when they were attacked the day before. Lin Chang tries to calm her down, but she pushes him away at first. He then carries her in his arms, prompting her to calm down. He returns to the house later that night to meet Miss Zhang, who's still waiting. She then warns him to give them feedback very soon or else Lin Chang will lose his job. Over the next one month, Lin Chang spends time with the snake girl, whom he eventually names Yi Yi. He teaches her how to eat, what to eat, what to drink and how to drink, and he also teaches her what to wear and how to wear it. At first, Yi Yi finds it hard to adjust, but from Lin Chang's research, he realizes that she has a high IQ. He also discovers that Yi Yi and the giant snake are connected and one can feel when the other is hurt or distressed. 
Another big discovery is that the giant snake feeds on Lithospermum glabra, which has modified the animal's DNA and caused it to grow unimaginably bigger than other normal snakes. And because that's what the snake feeds on, it tends to show aggression when guarding its meal, which explains why it's been attacking men who try to come close to their cave. Meanwhile, somewhere around town, it's revealed that Yang Fan has survived the attack and is plotting how to get revenge for his dearest friends. One night, at Lin Chang's residence, Miss Zhang comes back to visit to inform him that his time is up. She tells him that she will be sending some men over the following day to confiscate the house and research materials, as well as the girl. Meanwhile, the giant snake has tracked Yi Yi's location to the city and is currently researching for her. Some guy is seen on the phone at the park talking about business while his little daughter plays on her scooter. While playing, she gets kidnapped by some traffickers unknown to her dad. Thankfully, the girl gets saved by the snake. The little girl then helps the snake pull out an arrow that has been stuck in its tail before returning to her father. Afterwards, the snake goes on a rampage, attacking people around the city. Yi Yi senses her reptile friend's presence and gets Lin Chang to take her to the location. On reaching there, they realize that the snake is gone, but Lin Chang alerts the company that the snake is in the city. Seeing how sad Yi Yi is, Lin Chang takes her to a restaurant to cheer her up, only to realize that the restaurant sells snake meat. Yi Yi quickly picks up the scent of snakes and starts trashing the place. Suddenly, Lin Chang finds himself around multiple snakes with Yi Yi covered in snakes. He wakes up abruptly to find Yang Fan glaring at him and promising that they'll meet again before finally waking up from the actual dream. News of the snake's presence in the city soon spread, with authorities warning citizens not to come out at night not to wander beside rivers and to keep off the alleys until something is done about the snake. Meanwhile, Miss Zhang is having a discussion with Lin Zhang and her father, Mr. Zhang Hai. Zhang suggests that they seize the opportunity to capture the snake and examine it since its DNA contains traces of the lithospermum glabra plant. Lin Zhang tries to warn her that it might be too dangerous to mess with the snake, but Miss Zhang concludes that that's what they'll be doing. Lin Chang is expecting a positive reply from Mr. Zhang Hai himself, but he also seems to be on board with his daughter's horrible idea. Later, Lin Chang is talking with Mr. Zhang Hai and tries to convince him that they should stick to researching the plants and leave the snake and the girl out of it. But Mr. Zhang Hai explains to him that he has bought an entire forest where he plans to situate a sanctuary. He promises Lin Chang that Yi Yi and the snake will be allowed to dwell there and that he'll hand over the ownership of the forest to Lin Chang, but only after their research is complete. But Lin Chang refuses and pleads with him to let Yi Yi and the snake have their home. He wishes to send them back home and regrets bringing Yi Yi to suffer in the first place. But Mr. Zhang Hai orders him to lure Yi Yi to a place where the snake will be captured. After thinking long and hard about everything, and with his job on the line, Lin Chang takes Yi Yi out and tells her the story of his childhood. How his parents also worked with the research team and were too busy attending to pandemic-stricken countries to come back for him. His parents went from calling him every day to once a week and to once a month. Eventually, they stopped calling him. But the day they finally called, he didn't hear his father's voice and apparently, that was the last call he ever got from them, and the last he ever heard from them. After telling her his story, he realizes that Yi Yi might not even be able to understand human emotions, but she surprises him by gesturing at him to smile. She takes his hands, and just when he's about to kiss her, they're attacked by Zhang's soldiers, who immediately apprehend Yi Yi and make Lin Chang unconscious. When Lin Chang regains consciousness for a brief moment, his heart is torn as he watches Yi Yi being subdued by the soldiers and set up as bait to capture the snake. He also hears Mr. Zhang Hai's voice shaming him for being so weak that he falls in love with his test subject. After that, he blacks out again, 
Finally, the snake shows up as planned and gets caught in the trap put up for it. With the snake unconscious, the research team begins dissecting and experimenting. During the experiment process, Lin Chang regains consciousness. He realizes what's going on and starts to feel remorseful. He tries to leave but is stopped by the soldiers. Mr. Zhang Hai then instructs them to let him leave. With the experiment going on, Yi Yi and the snake are both near death. Lin Chang immediately rescues her while everyone's attention is on the snake. He tries CPR but to no avail in reviving Yi Yi. He then uses a car battery and jumper cables as an improvised defibrillator to revive her which also brings her reptile buddy back from the other side. This results in a war between the angry snake and a battalion of soldiers led by Yang Fan. During the fight, Miss Zhang and a good number of the soldiers bite the dust, while all Mr. Zhang Hai can do is watch them die. With Lin Chang's help, Yi Yi escapes with her snake friend, who has acknowledged Lin Chang as family. They return to the cave filled with the Lithospermum glabra plant, which fascinates Lin Chang. Yi Yi is still upset with Lin Chang for betraying her, so he stays in her lane all the while. Sadly, Lin Chang soon notices the tracker that had been attached to the snake's scales and realizes that it's not over yet. Meanwhile, Mr. Zhang Hai is on his way to the tracked location with a loop of soldiers to get to the Lithospermum glabra plant. He encounters Lin Chang at the mouth of the cave and he tries to warn Zhang Hai that he's getting himself into trouble. But Lin Chang is fed up with his attitude and shoots him in the leg. Lin Chang then offers to sacrifice himself for the two and urges Zhang Hai to shoot him in the chest, which the ruthless man does. He tells him that he's an idiot just like his parents, and it's revealed that Mr. Zhang Hai was the one behind Lin Chang's parents' death. The noise, however, stirs up the giant river bats that flock out to attack the men. Mr. Zhang Hai then takes cover inside the cave and realizes that he has finally found the Lithospermum glabra that led to all the catastrophe. He rejoices but is soon put to unrest when he realizes he's not alone in the cave. He falls down and loses his glasses, so he is unable to see. However, he's able to make out Yi Yi's image standing before him. He yells at her that the plant is all his and tells her to go away, but he gets swallowed by the snake. Finally, with the major problem out of the way, she rushes out of the cave to find Lin Chang in his final moments. As she mourns his helplessness, we're taken back to three days ago when Lin Chang found out that Yi Yi also had the DNA repair genes which could have backed up his research. But his research also reveals a 50-50 chance that the Lithospermum glabra plant could be a cure for all diseases and gene mutation, or a Pandora's box, which could unravel an even worse pandemic that no one knows. Refusing to further the research, he ends it there and disposes of all his research. Following his passing away, the Zhang Hai Pharmaceutical Group gets sealed up by the authorities for illegal scientific research activities and unlawful possession of weapons. The scene then opens up with the little girl who was saved by the snake riding her scooter. She then stops in front of a girl wearing a cap. The girl turns out to be Yi Yi, who is now seemingly fluent in human language and even acknowledges her name is Yi Yi. The two girls then look up at the tree to find the snake hissing at them. And this is the end. This was a recap of the 2021 movie Snake Girl, directed by Yin Yu. The movie stars Zhang Hao Yu, Xiao Yan Bo, Zhang Jin Yuan, and Guo Zhen. So, what do we think of all the snake's connected relationships with Yi Yi? And do you think it's unfair that Yi Yi doesn't get to be with her lover in the end? Let us know in the comments below with hashtag cinema recap. Until next time.